क्या आप जानते हैं कि ट्रांसफॉर्मर कैसे बनता है क्या आप जानते हैं कि ट्रांसफॉर्मर कैसे बनता है मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रोसेस ऑफ पावर ट्रांसफॉर्मर प्रेजेंटेड बाय इंजीनियर एंकिट किजारोनी इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर इफ यू आर नॉट सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल फर्स्टली सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल जीनियस ओन एंड गेट्स मोर अपडेट्स फ्लो चार्ट ऑफ ट्रांसफॉर्मर मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रोसेसेस Coil winding former according to the design rib type range is less umbrella type range is large according to the position vertical and horizontal copper conductors being used paper insulated copper conductor pick these co conductors are thin strips insulated using paper cellulose insulation pick are used in the form of single bunch double bunch or triple bunch on the requirements of turn and no of conductors coils are transposed at regular interval while preparing the winding depending upon the requirement continuous transposed conductor ctc ctc consists of a single paper insulated conductor with more than one no of conductors continuously transposed inside the insulation For example for a LV winding preparation a CTC with 43 numbers of conductors was used as the no of turns are usually less in the CTC type winding it is usually used to make LV coil autoclave in pressing after the coil preparation all the three coils LV HV and tap are separately put into autoclave for moisture removal from the paper insulations Autoclave is the process of removing the moisture from the dummy coil. For this process temperature is used 110 plus minus 10 degrees Celsius and this process is completed in 24 to 36 hours. After competition of this process dummy coil achieve the shrunk height which 85 to 86% of unshrunk height. Dummy coil assembly after all the three coils LV HV and tap winding have been prepared separately they are assembled on a dummy core with the LV HV and tap leads keeping open LV windings are normally placed near core over insulating cylinder and oil ducts HV windings are assembled coaxially placed with respect to LV spacers between coils are T shaped for added firmness coils are assembled with best insulating materials and are adequately clamped The winding is rigidly supported by a common spacer ring of densified wood at the top and bottom for precise alignment. Well profile angled rings are placed between LV and HV windings to reduce voltage stress level. The ends and tapping leads of all windings are connected by special extra flexible insulated copper cables which are rigidly braced in position. Core manufacturing Core is manufactured by the CRGO steel which is the combination of nickel, chromium and silicon steel. CRGO is imported according to the thickness. CRGO is divided into 3 grades. First M3 equals 0.21 to 0.23 mm. Second M4 equals 0.27 to 0.30 mm. Third M5 equals 0.30 to 0.35 mm. Fourth mainly M4 grade of CRGO steel is used. core cutting process core assembly there are mainly two types of core assembly pqr type and abcd type core coil assembly the coils after pre assembly on a dummy core are then lowered on the core legs and after top yoke filling the coils are clamped by pressure bolts VPD vapor phase drying after the CCA core and coil assembly is dried through a very efficient vacuum drying autoclave which ensures the extraction of moisture to zero level VPD process is completed in 4 to 5 days for this process kerosene is firstly changed into vapor phase then it is spray on the active part 
tanking, material used milled steel, carbon steel, milled steel is divided into three grades, grade A, very low quality steel for normal use, grade B, intermediate quality steel used till the 0 degrees Celsius, grade C, for less than 0 degrees Celsius to minus 20 degrees Celsius. Safety devices, the following protective devices are used so that upon a fault development inside a transformer, an alarm is set off or the transformer is disconnected from the circuit. In the event of fault, oil or insulations decomposes by heat, producing gas or developing an impulse oil flow. To detect this phenomenon, Butchholz relay is installed. Conservator Power transformer are provided with a conservator through which transformer breathes into the atmosphere through expansion and contraction of transformer oil. It is a small size tank placed on the top of the main tank top. Bushing, it's because it is mechanically strong, less affected by temperature and has minimum leakage problem. The high voltage connections pass from the windings to the terminal bushings. Terminal bushings up to 36 kV class, 3150 amperes, are normally of plain porcelain and oil communication type. Higher current rated bushing and bushings of 52 kV class and above will be of oil impregnated paper condenser type. The oil inside the condenser bushings will not be communicating with the oil inside the transformer. Thermosist Optic Fiber Temperature Sensor Testing, after active part assembly and the tanking process the transformer is sent to the testing area where various tests are done on the transformer. These tests are classified as follows there are mainly three types of test performed on the transformer, routine test perform on all the job is necessary, special test perform under special condition, customer requirement, type test perform only one of the job of the same types. Dispatching, main body of transformer is covered by polyethylene sheets while other loose accessories are shipped in standardized seaworthy wooden packing boxes with ship marks and contents specified for damage-free shipment. Many of transformers are dispatched with VCI packing looking towards the climatic condition of ultimate customer's destination. Shipment takes care of balancing of the weight while loading the transformer onto the transport vehicle. Proper welding is done on the base so that there is no scope of vibrations during transportation irrespective of quality of roads. Thank you.